Oops. So can we not get through this? I don't think we can yet. But I think we're supposed to be able to to go hug the guy. What the hell was that? Chat, I figured it out. Triangle logic smackdown. It's gonna be our first emote. <laughs> okay, let's... Hopefully we can hug a dude in here. All I want is a hug, chat. Oh, there he is. Come here. Wait. Come here. Why doesn't he... Where did he go? No! You fool! I will catch you and I will smother you in kindness! See, I don't think we've done that one before. I think that's the first time we've ever gotten that one. We're making progress, chat. We are making progress. I'm gonna go back in here one more time to make sure we haven't missed anything as well. Ooh, this looks like a button. Should we press it? It's the babies. So, they're just... So this is like a watch station. The, little, the janitor dude is just... He, he ha he's watching all this, the babies, the small children sleep. It's kind of kind of creepy. And I'm guessing maybe I was one of them at some point or something. Before I grew up and escaped! Alright, let's go upstairs. I've never d I've never done that part before. You do something new every day, Chad. It's like a springboard. There were some dudes in here we can potentially hug, I believe. Let's try going in here, see if they're stuck. Maybe they're hiding behind the door? No, they are not. We need to grab a key to this lock, and I believe it's in the next room. Oh, cool! Huh. Never broken one of those before. So we're gonna grab the suitcase over here and then pull this lever, this lever lever. You know, really, now that I think about it, we're smaller than a normal human child. Is 
the hell is that sound? And why are there straps to hold people down in this bed? Like, there's the key right there on top of that dresser, by the way. And here's pictures of all the characters in the game. The fat chef. The little dudes we've been hugging. The blind guy, the blind janitor. I think maybe this is the blind janitor's bedroom, potentially. I'm gonna go up here just to make sure there's nothing collectible. Oh, there's a Matryoshka doll! Hell yeah, nice. <laughs> gonna smash all this dude's stuff. Oh, we can't smash that one. Shit. Oh, that is quite the leaky pipe right there. Damn. Can we move the bucket? How satisfying. Agreed, Steen. The most satisfying. Alright, let's take this key and go open this door. Take this and throw it at that elevator door. Open it up. All the nice shoes that people are just leaving around. Oh, I think we need to throw. this at the button on the inside as well. Or not. <laughs> there we go. You're gonna hide in here in case something comes in here. I don't remember if it does or not, but. Just kidding. <laughs> Alright, so we're hungry again. This uh, little girl really needs to eat quite a lot of food. She's hungry like every five seconds. Every 30 minutes. Oh, hey, a lantern. Good eye. Good eye, chat. Just kidding, that was all me. Hmm. She also apparently dies if she doesn't eat every 30 minutes. You know, this cage looks suspicious as hell. Like, why is there just a piece of convenient raw meat in that cage? I think we die if we don't eat it, though, so we're gonna just... We're just gonna go for it. Oh, delicious. Delicious raw meat. Shit. It's the really long-armed janitor. What a fool we were. Dude, look how long his damn arms are. It's crazy.
All right, let's get out of here. If we can just knock this cage down, hell yeah. Okay. Go out here real quick, and I think this, yeah, so this is where we were earlier. I'm gonna light this lantern. So we came out of a door right there and went up these stairs. There's some older children as well back here, it looks like. But I never really noticed. Let's climb on top of these real quick, see if there's any collectibles up here. That is a long fall for a little little lady like her. Okay. We're gonna pull this over, jump on top of it, and then pull this lever to open this door. And then swing until we can get through. Oh shit, I forget how to do this one. Maybe climb up this? Yeah, there we go, nice. And there's not a lantern here, but there is a candle. So cl close enough, right? A candle and a delightful guillotine. That's kind of disgusting. And some super, super creepy, creaky boards in a bathtub. Shit, I forgot about this part. So here's our dude. We're gonna watch him for a second. If you look at him, he's taking the children and wrapping them up in these sacks and then hanging them on meat hooks. He'll grab another one in a second. Right, so I believe this would have been our fate if we... Look, there's another one. There's another child. <laughs> so again, he can only hear us when we're on the wood. So if we let, if we watch this pattern, and then only walk on cloth at the appropriate times. Should be good to go. We're gonna get to this little hole in the wall right over there. Run for it. Run, chat! Wait, 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 wait. Oh, God. Okay, we're good. I think he comes in here. Maybe not? Thing he's blind. He is one creepy looking dude.
We're gonna wind this up to try and lift this trap door as soon as he closes the door. Nice. Nope, nope, nope! Oh god, he almost got us. Oh god, that. Jesus. Alright, Steen, see you in a little bit. And then this kind of reminds me of like Holocaust museums that I've been to with the shoes here. And then look, look at all these shoes. They're, they're like a foot deep, just all the way across the room. Kinda crazy. Shit! Run from the creepy animal! Run! Push through those shoes! You fool! Okay, yeah. This part kinda reminds me of Star Wars, you know, in that little, um... Like one of the first movies that they ever made where they're in the garbage compactor and there's that little thing in the water. This reminds me of that. It like chases them down. Oh God, I hate this thing. I don't know if we're gonna make this one. Get on, get up. Okay, we're good. We're good, just kidding. I actually thought we might have been too slow there, but we're good. Okay. Oh, we can't get through that one? Damn. Oh, there's a mouse trap. Interesting. Oh shit! This is where the dude captured us. This is where we that baited trap was. I forgot about that. Okay, cool. So we're back here now. Shit! I forgot. I forgot. Oh god! Run! Wait, what? Ugh. Damn it. I actually don't know what, how we were too slow there. We were full out running the entire time. Maybe we shouldn't slide to get under that thing. He's gonna catch us this time again. Nope, we got it, we made it! Hell yeah. Hell yeah. So we think he's gonna find this there, but because we've been helping these little dudes out the whole time, they actually help us out and run from them. And distract him so that we can make our escape. I think if we push this out of the way, we can fall down through this board. Yeah. Nice. So, Ekin, 
how was that game that you were playing going? The one you're trying to finish before October. Do you think you're going to be able to make it? Oh, here's a huggable dude. Get back here, you fool. I think this actually might be the last huggable dude. If we look above us, I believe that the guy, the janitor, is up here. I think we're in his bedroom or something, or his, co his collection of toys. No? But before we go up there and try and sneak past him, we're going to grab this Matryoshka doll right here. We're gonna try and find this other dude to hug. I think he's somewhere around here. Maybe, maybe he's farther up, I think. Um, okay. Well, real quick, I'm gonna take a quick bio break. I'll be right back. And enjoy whatever drink you have, get up, stretch your limbs maybe. And yeah, I'll see you in a couple seconds. And we're back. Okay, let's do this. We're gonna try and sneak past this guy. It's going good, but I do think, you do not think you can finish it before October. Well, damn, that sucks. You're gonna have to grind out the extra hours. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like quite the long game. Okay, before we go up here to try and sneak past this guy, let's double check. Make sure there's no huggable dudes back here. I really, for some reason, I'm remembering that there is, but maybe not. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. All right, so here's the deal with this. When we're walking on this carpet, we're fine, but when we get over there, we can't walk on carpet. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna throw this guy as far over here as we can. It's gonna distract him. And he's gonna run over there and stop it. And then we're gonna creep past him slowly. Ah! Okay. And then we have to climb up this thing. And the problem is, if we climb up this thing and he comes in here, he can actually reach us almost all the way to the top. So we have to get all the way up here. Okay, we're good. We should be good. His arms are hella long. Yeah, it's a long game. Yeah, it sounds like a long game, but a really cool game. Look at this doll. Its face is like melted in. That's kind of disgusting. It looks kind of like almost like an ear. A little strange. Okay. Let's continue forward. I died there so many times the first play, the first time I played this game. <laughs> Have you beaten the whole thing before, Eakin? Or just played parts of it? Oh shit. Everybody be quiet. You're back, Steen. Hello again. Okay, so I don't think he's gonna come down here. Let's look around this room for collectibles before we move on. A room full of clocks, a lot of which have been broken. I don't see any. No, never, oh nice. Well, good then. I think he's gonna come after us when we get down here. See if we can throw a shoe at this to open it up. He makes so much noise. <laughs> Crap! Okay, he's chasing us. No! Oh, come on, let me through. Nice. 
All right, we're good. I think we're safe in here. I think. Those chase scenes, I've played many times, but really they still make me as um, tense as they did the first time. There's just something about being chased that's quite awful. Okay, so there's a candle up here that we can light. Nope, oh, go on, light it. 